Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be trying to make a very fun video. I am pretty much all day on my phone. Um, if it isn't like social media, it's reading. And if it isn't reading, um, it's for school. So I spent a lot of time on my phone. And today, I'm going to be trying to use the amount that i am on my phone on average and turn that into um, reading time so i'm gonna check on my phone how much i spend on it and then we're gonna start reading okay so i just checked and um on average i am on my phone for five hours and 50 minutes um, each day which I think is like pretty okay. I thought it was gonna be like eight hours a day, but I will be spending that amount of time to reading. And the first book is gonna be Kiss the Sky by Christian Beccarucci. I'm obsessed with the Addicted series right now. And this is the fourth book when you read them in the right order, because this is actually the Galloway Sisters series and then the Addicted series which is only about Lauren and Lily, but the Callaway Sisters series, I don't know what it's called, is about Rose and Daisy. And this is the first book about Rose and Connor. So I will try to not spoil anything, but I cannot guarantee that there won't be like some teeny tiny context spoilers. Um, but I, everything major will not be spoiled. I did already read today um, for like a half hour, so I'm going to include that in the time because it does count. I read for half an hour today. So yeah, and I read 26 pages. It's going to be a fun video, so we're also going to see how fast I can read. I don't know if I'm going to be finishing this book in the five hours because it is 440 pages, something like that. Um, but yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I have been reading for one hour and 20 minutes and I am at page 118. And I would say that's pretty good. That's like almost 100 pages in under an hour because when I was like at half an hour, I read like 26 pages, so in 10 minutes, I'd definitely be able to read like 10 pages. So like, I read almost 100 pages in almost an hour. And I'm happy with that. I'm also really loving Rose and Connor. Do I love them more than Lily and Lauren? At the moment, no. I think they might be my second favorite couple because I'm not really feeling the vibe with Daisy and Rag at the moment. Even though I know that they're like the favorite of a lot of people. I also just haven't read any of their books yet so it's hard to like judge their relationship. Um, but I'm really liking it. If I, you know, keep reading like I'm reading now, so like 100 pages an hour, I can definitely finish this book in like three hours so that leaves me for one hour left like i'm not seeing it as a possibility that i will get to read another book because i only have like four hours and 30 minutes left that i have to read but i'm anticipating a bit so i'm already choosing which book i'm going to read next okay so the first book is fake empire by cw um Farnsworth and this is like two billionaires that have been arranged to get married since they were 15. And now they like have to get married when they're 25 years old. And it's like, they're both equals in every way possible. Like, I think she's like sometimes even more powerful, or wealthy, whatever you want to say. And it's, it's just really intriguing me. And the second book is Phantom by Greer Rivers. This is a dark romance book and I am insanely obsessed with dark romance at the moment. I read Corrupt by Penelope Douglas and since then I've been in a dark romance kind of mood. This is 
I think like he's like mafia and he's been obsessed with her for like a long time, but he never approached her up until one point. And that's like I I think that's where the where the book starts. Like he approaches her and it's full of red flags, I think, but you know, the one place that it's fine to ignore them is in books. I also heard that I mean they say it's a dark modern romantic retelling of the musical classic Phantom of the Opera. So that's intriguing me and also there are like so beautiful illustrations in here, like they're photos, but it's so beautiful. Like, look at this. This is gorgeous. So those two are high on the list. Um, but I'm gonna keep reading Kiss the Sky first and we'll see if I have time for another book. <laughs> and 42 minutes into my reading time and I think I completely underestimated this and I have like it's insane how much time on my phone I am and it doesn't seem that long um, but I am at page two three four so like almost halfway so I have I have read this part and I'm still reading I mean, I am over halfway in the book, so I hate Scott so much, like he can leave right now, like the amount of times that I've wanted to hit him in the face is unreal. He's so annoying and conceited and just a big asshole, so yeah. I'm not really the biggest fan of the reality TV plot. I don't know, it kind of makes like their interactions sometimes seem forced and especially when they like air the episode there can be like some miscommunication and I'm, I don't like that. So for now this is probably one of the least of the books that I've read from the Addicted series. I still have like almost 200 pages left to read so my mind can be changed. Connor and Rose have not yet convinced me that they are worth like the number one spot um, in the series. Lily and Lo are still on the top. But I do like like the moments that they have in this book and that they are not like portrayed as the addicts that as much in the books um, that are about the other couple as they are in their own books, which makes sense because it's not really about them, this book. I love how they also can be portrayed as a normal couple um, and just have fun. Um, I'm gonna keep reading. Um, I'll probably only be able to finish like my hours late in the evening because I have to leave for a couple of hours as well where I won't be able to read. 
yeah i'm gonna try to read as much as i can now so that i don't have to read like for three hours in the evening um but yeah i'll see you later <laughs> and 50 minutes which means that the challenge is done and i completely underestimated it i did not expect it to be this hard because five hours and 50 minutes does not seem long when i'm on my phone but i completely underestimated this but during this time i finished kiss the sky and i really loved it um lo and lily keep the number one spot but connor and rose are an amazing couple as well and i love them um but i didn't miss lily and though even though we had some moments from them um and they were like very much present in this book i missed them but nonetheless this is a four star book um and in the last 50 minutes i started fake empire and i am absolutely loving this i am at chapter 8 page 100 so i read about 100 pages in an hour but this book reads so fast and it's so good like they're both grumpy but she is like a bit more a little more grumpier than he is which is amazing i absolutely love it um so i think like in five hours and 50 minutes i read 500 and 540 pages which is quite a lot so that's like at least like almost 100 pages in an hour I didn't think I would read that fast, um, but I did anyway. Um, but that was the video, I hope you liked it. Um, leave a like, subscribe, comment, and I hope I'll see you for the next video. Bye! <laughs>